and welcome back to the channel on this video as I ride around on the clear graffiti I wanted to talk about something that uh, folks do on their electric bikes some people and How many out there do this? And that is wheelies on their e-bike. First off, right off the bat, I can tell you that I am not a wheelie person, so I don't do wheelies on mine, but I remember one day last summer I was riding around and there was a group of kids, young kids, and one of them yelled out to me, he says, hey, he says, Papa Wheelie, Papa Wheelie. He kept saying, Papa Wheelie. And I uh, just rode right by, but it was kind of funny how this kid, probably eight years old, is thinking of wheelies, you know. He's, he's probably seen somebody riding doing wheelies before. And, uh, I mean, I've watched videos of the group rides, like in L.A. and in New York and stuff. And uh, a lot of those guys will be doing their wheelies and right on the on the main road and I gotta say I kind of cringe every time I see that because I I think something's gonna happen in a negative way so uh, I'm not a wheelie guy but I I know that a lot I shouldn't say a lot, but some out there are wheelies, wheelie uh, guys or girls. Um, but what other uh, crazy things do people do? Well, they do lots of stuff on their bikes. I can remember as a kid doing crazy things like, you know, here I am 10 years old doing stuff and you look back and you, you're thinking, what was I doing? You know, thinking of doing these crazy things that I was doing and I would do stuff like jumping ramps and I think young boys particularly mm -hmm. probably it's mm -hmm. something a lot of us out there probably done you know when we were kids I I can say for one I have you know sometimes it gets to the point where some kids would be jumping grocery carts shopping carts and they would see how many they can jump kind of like the evil Knievel thing you know if you grew up back in the evil Knievel era then you'll know what kind of daredevil evil Knievel was and uh, maybe maybe we were trying to pretend we were evil Knievel I don't know I don't remember that but Uh, and then some other crazy stuff. I know one thing I used to do, and I don't know why I did this. I would get riding along and then stand up on my seat and steer, you know, steer with my hands just the same, but but uh, be standing on the seat. I don't know what I was trying to prove or accomplish there, but I remember doing that. And as far as e-bikes, and riding the e-bike and being crazy I don't really do the crazy stuff I guess the craziest thing I've done and I did a video uh, where I was I wasn't intending to do this it just came to be that I did I was out one morning about five in the morning doing a video and this was I don't know what time of year it was but it was cold out it was not cold enough to snow it was rain it was raining it was cold like I'm gonna say 40 degrees probably and when you got rain and 40 degrees and wind that makes for a cold uh, ride on your e-bike and I remember I was riding down if you're familiar with this area, um, Tigard or King City area, you'll know uh, Durham Road. 
and I was riding down Durham Road toward 99W and I uh, I um, wanted to get going get quickly out of the weather situation it wasn't the most ideal rain rain wind cold you know ideal it wasn't the most ideal riding weather and so I uh, was gonna turn down there but there's a car coming but I was whipping down the road at about 34 miles an hour on my uh, aerial rider grizzly there was no cars on my in my uh, lane and my, going my direction there was a couple that came the other way and this was in the dark five o'clock in the morning and I think that's probably the craziest thing I've done on an e-bike. If you call that crazy, I mean, I don't think riding 34 miles per hour is crazy, really. It was the conditions that I was riding in. It was it was crappy weather uh, outside, and uh, but there was nobody around, and I thought I'm just gonna boot it and get home ASAP. So. That was probably, I, I would think, my craziest ride. Let me know what your craziest ride is, be it on an e-bike or on a bicycle. I'm sure there's some people out there who have done some crazy things. But just be careful, I mean, don't hurt yourself. Um, I'm to the point now where I wouldn't want to even try to do anything crazy nor do I want to really I'm not into the the thrill seeking like that I mean if anything I'm I'd be guilty of in that would be just riding a little bit faster maybe but when I say faster none of my bikes go beyond maybe 35 possibly 36 miles per hour so it's not super duper fast but I guess on a bike it's fast but uh And I'm pretty sure when I get my Lyric Graffiti X, I'm gonna have to at least take it one time to do a speed test to see what we get on. I'm sure I'm gonna have to do that. I mean, how many of us out there get a new e-bike and don't test to see how fast the bike is capable of going? I mean, I think most of us do that. We're just curious as to how fast we can really go on the bike. A lot of times, most bikes are gonna be 25 maybe, maybe 28, class three. You might get it to the 30. Like I know the Ride One Up, uh, my most recent bike, the Ride One Up Cafe Cruiser, I've gotten it up into just a little bit over 30. And I was pedaling like mad. Uh, you know, you wouldn't be able to sustain that, but um, just to see how fast it would go. I think it got up to 32 or something like that. Just a little bit above 30. But, uh, yeah, I think I think we like to see how fast our bike will go, but we're not going to ride like that all the time. And like I say, with none of my bikes uh, would go... Uh, overly fast like I mean 35 is still fast right but that's not that much over what a class 3 bike is 28 so it's not much over what a class 3 bike would be anyway but uh yeah so let me know in the comments what what's your craziest ride you've ever done like on your bike craziest thing on your bike maybe it was uh the, maybe the craziest thing was a, a crazy ride that went took you you know 100 miles or something i don't know maybe that was your thing you did a, a crazy ride it was a long one that could be a crazy ride i'm not going crazy right now i'm just riding nice and slow because I'm in a residential area and I don't know this area has lots of kids around so I don't want to have a kid darting out oh I shouldn't have done that way.
speed limit in these residential areas for the most part is 25, sometimes it's 20. Alright, well that's going to do it for this video. I just want to talk a little bit about crazy riding and uh, doing wheelies and what maybe is the craziest thing you've ever done on your e-bike. Or maybe it's something you've done that's crazy on your traditional bike. Let me know in the comments below. And hey, if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, thank you very much for doing that and supporting us. And if you want to be notified, I'll just hit the subscribe button. I didn't mention that, but that's all you have to do for subscribing. And if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified. Once again, if you want to leave a comment on this or any other video, go ahead and leave that in the comments below. And thank you very much for joining me on this video. And until next time, keep your wheels on the road. Talk to you later.